we moved to our house out here in California, we've been throwing all of our change in a bucket, whether it's from the flea market, change from a store, change from wherever in this bucket. I've been waiting for the bucket to get to right at 100 pounds before we cashed it in. And today, we are just about at 100 pounds. So I figured we're gonna take it to the store and see how much money is in this bucket. So here's our big bucket of change. It may not look like much, but this bucket is huge and it finally weighs like right at 100 pounds. Ooh, it's a lot more than that, isn't it? Whoa. Come on, scale. Close enough. Yeah. It said 99.4 <laughs> earlier. 97.3 now, I guess we have unstable floors. But about 100 pounds worth of change. Let's go take it to the store. Before we do that, what's your guess? How much change do you think's in there? There, I know that it looks like a lot of pennies. That's because the last unit had a lot of pennies. But there's a lot of quarters in there. There's half dollars, there's gold dollars, there's all kinds of stuff in there. Before we go, I want everyone in this house to take bets. They're all calling me crazy because I'm saying it's going to be $500 in there. What do you think's going to be in there? I think it's going to be more like 120 to 130 oh somewhere gosh. in there. It's a yeah. lot of pennies too. I think I want to originally said 160, but I think because of a lot of pennies, I'm going to say like 200. And think? I shall say probably around 300. So that's my guess. It's gonna be 500. It might be more than 500. I'm telling you, I'm the, I put those quarters in there. There's a lot of quarters in there. I'm on an island. Well, let's get this big mama to the car. You know, it's not even that it's that much weight. It's that it's like two little plastic divots digging into my palms and it doesn't feel really good at all. Let's get it in the back. Do you think it's gonna fit? I don't know. We'll see. Come on. Jeez. It's well, gonna sit right there. Should I buckle okay. it up? <laughs> yeah, buckle it oh, up. Let me buckle it up. See, look at it now. Look at the chain. Safe, secure, we're good to go. Let's do it. Before we get our kid out, we gotta have a basket for him to sit in right here. Stop scratching the car, you know. <laughs> Round the car. All right, let's get our I'll son hold, out. I'll hold the basket. All right, let me unbuckle him. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Stop crying. Stop crying. Oh, it's sad it's leaving us. Stop. It's been with us for so long. Ugh. Ugh. Wow. That's a lot of change. All right. Dr. Jeeves reporting for duty. Let's go do surgery on this change. Can you believe these things want to charge you now? 12.5% plus a dime. That's way too much. So you know what we're going to do? Take the e-gift card and go with, well, get a load. Where is it at? Amazon.com. Because I think we use Amazon Prime like, what, three, five times a week? So oh, for sure. Easy. Let's see. And we don't have to pay no fees. So that makes it better. What will you use for this transaction? You put bills in there? Yeah, I didn't think you could. Coins. Boy, coins. All right, you ready? Oh. The moment we've been waiting for. This is kind of an awkward size now, you know? Put all that in there first. It's gonna take a little while. You see how, much lit, how little of a dent that is in the whole thing? At least we're gonna get all the pennies out the way first. There it goes. How do you feel about your bet now? <laughs> feeling I'm feeling good about it. I think it's a lot more pennies, it looks like, than silver. I think I'm going to be closer. No, nope. I'm going to win this. Remember, we're paying no fee, so that amount is the exact amount when we're done. Because there's no fee for a gift card. I do. I appreciate that. When it has to do that, you feel like, yeah, it's fun yeah. It's half past the wrist bone, man. We don't got time all day for this. You still think your argument's valid if you're $120. Yeah, it's 120 to 140. I think no way. No way. That's this is just the pennies on top, and we didn't even make a dent into this thing. Not even a dent. I'm starting to feel scared of my numbers too little. We'll go to the bottom at the end. By the way, before anybody asks, yes, there's no silver in here. There's no million dollar pennies in here. I check all my change. I'm one of those crazy people. We're just gonna 
break the machine, aren't we? Might. We're gonna break the machine. We got too much chain for it. Uh-huh. Has everyone heard about the whole, apparently there's like a chain shortage in the U.S. now? We're getting rid of all ours. We're gonna stop that shortage right here today. Oh, they should take and not take away. I know. Somehow there's a shortage when the coins are minted every year. They're just vanishing or something. Look at this. We're almost at 60 bucks. I mean, I'm not gonna touch it yet. Diamond. For me. Alright. We got the first little bit down. We're almost at $70 already. Your number is going to get blown out the water. Just saying. Yeah, I think I'm, think I'm a loser. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Ugh. I still have a chance, however. Hmm. I think I put too much in there. Take your time. I'm trying here. I'm trying. I'm trying. See, I mean, after pennies, but quarters is still the highest after the pennies. Look. Staple. You ever wonder how weird things get in change jars? We're about to cross the first hundred. How are you feeling still? You still think your 300 is going to be good? I think so. You do? <laughs> I'm sticking with my five. Look how much more we have. A lot more to go. 100 bucks already. You know there's probably at least a few dollars right here. Should I wait till the end to get it all? Yeah, wait till it's all done. Alright. Look at my hands now. Dirty money. Yeah. Dirty hands mean clean money. Remember that. Dirty hands mean clean money. I think we're gonna break the machine. Yeah, I think we are. It's gonna get stuck halfway and be like, hey, we don't got no more room. Can I say that this is like a pretty loud machine too? I hope you guys can hear us. It's pretty <laughs> loud and you know, we gotta wear this stupid mask too, so it doesn't help. Oh look, your 120 is gone. Well, yeah, like I said, I think I've <laughs> lost this competition. What was Baby Jeebus at? 200. Oh, I just pushed a little screw in there. I saw it go. Um. We're almost to the second wave, guys. Almost to the second wave. More staples. Where do staples keep coming from? I don't know. One of the random drawers we have in that unit. Probably random we have stuff. Like random jars of change and drawers of change and storage units. We just throw it all in there. Look how many pennies are in there. Over 2,000. I told you there was a lot of pennies. There's a lot of coins in there, too. All the times we went to the flea market and got tons of quarters from people, they all went in here. All right, ready for the next round three. Let's do a little wax this time. already. Broke it again. Good going, good going. Look what you did. Look guess, what you did. You guys did this. Guess who's not putting coins in there? Not my fault. Oh look. A San Francisco Giants key. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's put that where it belongs. In the only giants that are good are from New York. In the garbage. Maybe not recently, but historically. Anything else in here? More staples. More staples. 
These staples are really becoming a staple of this coin bucket. Yeah, I went there. Uh, Stop buffering. <laughs> it's buffering too much. Now look through here, see if we can take anything out. Found something. What? A pearl. <laughs> A pearl found in the team. Mm. A half dollar. Look, he's already been stuck. One dollar. We're coming up on a two hundred dollar mark, guys. There's a lot of change down here at the bottom. I have to get it. You have to get it soon. What? No, I want to throw them in there. Count five dollars. Wait, let me see him. See, that's a whole dollar. Even a bison penny will have dollars. What's the thing? It's all stored, you need to jump on it. Two hundred. Baby Jeebus loses too. He said two hundred. I think we know the clear winner here. Sorry, <laughs> Baby Jeebus. Mine's three, so we still got a hundred and ninety-five. If it goes to four oh one, I'm closer than you. I feel like Jeebus already counted. Yeah, totally. Oh, cheater. I counted three thousand two hundred pennies, two hundred nickels, three hundred dollars, five hundred quarters, eight half dollars, and four dollars. He would do that to be right. He would do that to be right. He doesn't even know me. Oh yeah, I only birthed him and raised him. You're right, I don't know him. All right, round four. We're going into the championship round. Probably two more rounds left in there. Or the screw. Let's get that out. I see gold dollars in there, look. I see four of them right here. Okay, now look. There's four more. Five. Better count them. There it goes. No, no, I didn't. You counted two of them. Gold dollars are those weird coins that for some reason everybody keeps them because they think they're worth something and they're worth a dollar, that's it. We're almost at the $250 mark. Come on. $250. You know how hot I am under this right now? Very. I had to do the drop below the load. <gasps> You're so selfish. Me too. <laughs> so selfish, God. It's so hot. Oh my God. Alright. Round five. Ugh. I think I'll wait too much. Coming up on three. At least you learned who the vast underestimators are in this house. $120. It looks like a lot of pennies in here. 
4,000 of them. Well, that's what I'm saying. They add up. Yeah, but that would only have been $42 so far, so. There's also 660 quarters right now. I didn't even know there was any gold dollars or half dollars in there. Here come the excuses. I didn't know. He cheated. He knew what was in there. I, what a cheater. <laughs> She's acting like I didn't say all this before we started. I let you win. Mm -hmm. Crazy lady. Crazy. What? Crazy. It's a lot of change. It's way more than I thought. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take the L from my guess now because it's already at 288. <laughs> Told you guys. I don't know if it'll be quite 500. I definitely think it'll be over four for sure. If it's 401 cent, what if it's 400 even? Oh. Then you guys and I'm running out to the car to grab a penny. What am I going to get with $500 on the Amazon? I might have the... I don't know. We got to be creative. What's some crazy video ideas? You know some old school Mr. Beast stuff back in the day? Craziest things you can find on Amazon? That would be fun. <laughs> Let us know in the comments, guys, if you want to see one video what like that? that. What is it? They're probably like a Dutch one. Well, they took like, like a whole other round down here to return the partner. There's a lot. Yeah. Do you want to go ahead and denounce your victory now? I already did. All right, good. <laughs> I did that at like 280. <laughs> but the way it's going so far, you might win the microwave challenge. Guys, if you haven't watched the video, go back and watch the microwave video from yesterday. Tell me which object was the coolest. I still say my egg, but a lot of people are saying your phone. Well, mine's between the dove and the phone. That's why people said I won. Well, it was a one object choice. Amazon has market pantry too. We can do grocery shopping on Amazon. No. Why? We love cool stuff from Amazon. We need videos. Oh, I was thinking like <laughs> almonds and Brazil nuts and protein bars. All right. We can get some of that stuff too. Here's the end of it, guys. Go ahead and grab that and that. In the Dutch coin. Throw that away. Four Dutch coins. I don't know, Amber might be the winner here. It's gonna be close. It's gonna come down to the wire right now. Uh, I think there's 70 some dollars. I'm not Nothing. above running to the car to get change out of the car. I'm not above that. I know. <laughs> Let's fill the change down in the corner. Yeah, don't forget that change. We just end it now. Jeez. Five thousand pennies. Whoever store unit that came out of, stop putting staples of money. Dang, whole key. Whole half key. You know what's funny? We're over here making a corn star video, probably being very loud, and then you have all these other people over here. They're just, you know, quietly doing their grocery shop. <laughs> Wondering why we have a big camera at the corn star machine. <laughs> they should all subscribe to Treasure Hunting with Jeebus. It'd be the best decision of their lives. Is Danny getting a little nervous now? You <laughs> know? Yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I'm feeling a little bit better. Oh my, there's a whole round down there. You want me to back up? Mm, you don't have to, yeah. into the bucket. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna knock some into it. Oh, look at those small colors. That's gonna make it go up a lot.
not as much as I thought. That's because this bucket's huge. I'm not about to lose by like 20 bucks, am I? <laughs> no. No, 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 no. And what did you say anyway? Didn't you say like 500? Yeah. It has to be over 400. You said three, right? Yeah. I think you got me. I think you got me. Alright. Penny. Corn coins. Smashed by a train penny. I used to do that. Look at that one. Oh no. <laughs> He's still digging through that thing down there and trying to put more in there. Canadian. It's looking a little scarce here. Canadian smushed. No. When it came down to the wire, I think I'm a loser. Oh look, that was just 15 gold dollars. What? <laughs> That wouldn't be enough. Oh, these, it's not going to take yeah, these no pennies. Way. We'll go that one. That's, no. Well, I think we're done then. You got me. By less than $18. <laughs> That's it. Oh, 382 dollars or the Amazon gift card for 380. Uh, I'd say Amazon gift card. Yep. Uh, never have. I've never heard of it. I don't want your spam email. <laughs> uh, Aha! You did it. I feel defeated. I feel Who defeated. Who did it? I did it. Uh, don't let nobody see this. this. Is our secret number? Let me see. Come no. On. Come on. Let me look. I guess she got me, guys. I lost there in square. See you at home. Before we go home, you know we had to get some keto ice cream. Check it out. Shout out to Enlighten. That's yep. right, shout out to Enlighten for sure. Mint chip and peanut butter fudge. $382.77. If you ever wanted to know what was in 100 pounds of change, now you have your answer. I still cannot believe I lost this challenge over, what, $17 and some change? Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. <laughs> you think I can get back on get his foot up that high, did you? <laughs> but anyway, thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed it, leave it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new, and until next time, peace out.